Today I want to talk about one of my favorite perennial vegetables, the awesome artichoke. I have experimented with many different forms of perennial vegetables over the year. Most of them are pretty good. Um, my two favorites definitely are the awesome artichoke and then the clever chive. I really enjoy chives a lot too. But right now we have some beautiful artichokes coming onto these plants. So if you happen to live where the climate is mild enough for this wonderful perennial vegetable and you don't have them already in your garden, I highly recommend you add the awesome artichoke to your planting. Now, I've been raising artichokes in California now for around 25 years. I uh, even had a little stint in the uh, Midwestern United States and Wisconsin of attempting to raise artichokes. Uh, much, much more difficult in that kind of a cold winter climate. But out here in California or in any other Mediterranean climate on the planet, this is an easy vegetable. It's actually a thistle. It's related to thistles, and it's good for you, like a lot of the thistles are. It'll help clean the liver and so on. It's a good blood cleanser. My plants here in my garden, I have three different varieties of artichokes here. And I've had most of these plants with me now for at least 20 years. I know I've had them in two gardens here in California. Same plants, keep bringing them around with me. Right over here we have Imperial Star. Now, this is one of the newer thornless varieties. Doesn't have any pokers on it at all. Um, it's a good artichoke. It yields really well. Um, it, some of us who really like the stronger flavored chokes find this one a little bit on the mild side. Over here I've got an Italian heirloom variety. This is a nice hearty artichoke. It definitely has uh, the barbs. There's little thorns on the edges of the leaves so when you eat it you have to take those off. Um, that's a good hearty artichoke. It's got a great flavor to it. This one's very tasty. And over here I've got the classic green globe uh, with a little ladybug. Green Globe is one of the older forms that we use. Uh, all of these were uh, cutting grown and so they're uniform. They can also be grown from seeds but they're not as uniform when you when you grow them from a seed. So I like artichokes because they're easy to grow in California. They come back year after year after year without having to replant them. Cooking with artichokes is awesome. Most of us are familiar with just steaming the choke, peeling it down and eating it, which is how I started eating this plant. But after a while, that gets a little old. Um, the Imperial Star variety, because it's thornless, if you pick them nice and young like these are, you can steam them and they just cut the top end of the choke off, toss it in the compost, and the whole rest of this thing is edible. There's no fuzz on the inside, none of the choke when it's uh, on the young side, and there's no thorns in here. So then I just dice them up and I stir them up in pasta with garlic and Parmesan cheese and a little bit of olive oil. Uh, I love them cold in a salad or just to marinate the artichokes. Again, use them in a salad. So many different sorts of salads. Uh, recently, I had started making artichoke soup. This is a new favorite of mine, artichoke soup. Oh, oh, oh. I made one the other day that utilized uh, artichokes cut into chunks in stock with black pepper, parsley, sage, thyme, two cloves of garlic, half an onion, two carrots. So all that was in the soup. It was amazing. It was so good. Okay. Uh, there's also, there was a chunky style soup. There's also some puree soups you'll see on the web. That's the most common form of artichoke soup. Both the Carmel style or the French style is where they grind it all up. Sometimes they eat them with potatoes in there too to thicken the broth. Uh, however you do it, artichoke soup is just incredible. That's a new one for me. And so I'm still working on trying to develop different ways of using the, uh, uh, the vegetable. But even if you don't do anything besides just steam them and sit down and eat them, these things are wonderful. I highly recommend growing artichokes. Happy gardening. Thanks for watching. <music>